if you can't be right yeah. I do the same thing I told you that I never would Hello we just watched Alice's vlog, and I've decided that I'm gonna blog, vlog our last however many, my last however many days of Copenhagen. Today's the 14th, and my last day is on the 23rd, kind of the 24th. So I guess this is my last 10 days in Copenhagen vlog. Who did we bump into? Rosa! She's going to her exam while we go to Amsterdam, Brussels, and Belgium. Oh, wait, no, Brussels and Berlin. in Amsterdam and now we're waiting for the train. How's the flight guys? <laughs> <laughs> Many realizations happen on that flight. What? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Made a pretty big discovery for Anna on the flight. What was the discovery? The discovery is that I did not bring any pajamas. <laughs> oh. uh, that's very rough. <laughs> Two weeks. Maybe just buy some. <laughs> Hi guys, so this is where we are right now. We walked right out of the metro station and we saw a canal tour thing. So now we're just going with our luggages. <laughs> Alice Bun! <laughs> <laughs> Paper time in Amsterdam. Alice, what are you working on? Logistic cluster. Woo! I'm working on visual communications. Here we go. <laughs> Today after breakfast, we went to the Anne Frank house. Um, that was probably one of my top experiences on exchange because we learned about it in school and then they had a lot of like original things from the house, like the countertop of the kitchen. Here's Queenie. Um, what else was original? Uh, some of the stairs, the bookcase. Yeah. The bookcase that hid the entrance into their secret annex. And then they had the real like first diary of Anne Frank in a case. and. It was a lot smaller than I would have expected, so that was really cool to see the actual thing. Um, okay, so now we are getting our daily COVID tests because we do not have an EU COVID passport. So Anne and Alice have one from Switzerland, but me and Queenie do not. So we are getting Flash COVID tests not. every day. <laughs> Here's Amsterdam. <laughs> So there's like a cheese shop upstairs. Um, the guy's really nice. He's like giving people samples. And then they have a little music down here. Queenie and her lactose intolerance. <laughs> Oh, it's still not sparkling, so you taste it. <laughs> <laughs> 
this one. Hello, it is our last day of Amsterdam. Um, we are currently at the Van Gogh Museum. And it's crazy, it's like 14 euros, so that's like $20, a little bit over to be here. And the Van Gogh exhibit in Vancouver is like $50. So, super goes to the actual Van Gogh Museum. Dutch cookies. They were they're very Dutch. <laughs> the Dutch cookies kind of tasted like the Danish um, pepper nuts one. Would you agree, Anna? That's actually yeah. the first thing she said, so that wasn't a real question. Would you agree, Biscoff, Alice? Yeah. Biscoff, Biscoff, yeah. Biscoff and pepper nut? Yeah. Okay. Would, how, what would you rate the Dutch cookies? Out of 10? Out of 10. That's like a 7 out of 10. Yeah. That's a little too high for me. <laughs> how about you, Alice? Six, six point five. I'd say a four. <laughs> what? We've just arrived in Rotterdam. It is how far away from Amsterdam? It was like an hour maybe on the train. Yeah, it was like 58 kilometers away from Amsterdam. And Alice, why did we come to Rotterdam? <laughs> because we're in the global supply chain and logistics management program. Duh. <laughs> okay, but like, what is in Rotterdam? For those who do not know, the port of Rotterdam is like massive. We are at the port of Rotterdam now. A uh, fun story: when I was working at C-SPAN, the shipping company. Um, this lady at every meeting, she would just mention Rotterdam. So, now we're here. What's up gamers? We got to the Rotterdam port and now we're taking a water taxi to the container ships. And it's going so fast that the boat's like raising up. I, I don't know how to shoot it, but. Yeah, it's like not flat. It's like this because we're going so fast. Five Korean hot dogs together. Yeah, and not each. Oh yeah, <laughs> and frozen yogurt. 